Hello, Sagittarius. Welcome back, everybody. Thank you so much for the support. All right. Thank you so much for tuning back in. Everything you need to know about me, Sagittarius, will be in the description box below. Thank you so much for all the subscribes. If you have subscribed yet, please do so. Also, I also wanted to say thank you for all the donations, okay? I really, 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 highly, highly, highly appreciate all the donations, Sagittarius, okay? So let's get some important messages here, please, for my Sagittarius. There you are, looking very good, bold, brave, beautiful, confident, and powerful, all in one. The lovers here. So there is a Gemini, definitely a Gemini could be. I'm always talking of lately, we've been having a lot about Gemini energy, so there could definitely be a Gemini cross watcher here, watching for Sagittarius. Hey, Gemini, okay, if you are here, welcome, welcome, welcome. For others of you, I do feel like you are um, falling in love with your mind. Somebody is falling in love with the way they think, the way they, like, somebody is starting to fall in love with, like, their self. I love this. So, like, you, you're turning yourself on. Like, you like, damn, I'm so motherfucking smart. Like, I'm a motherfucking smart-ass person. Like, I just love myself. <laughs> the love is the queen of wands. The temperance is the queen. This is definitely you. Both energies is you. You're coming out very strong. And then you're like, man, I love, like, the way I'm thinking. Like, I love how I don't play that shit. Like, I love how I'm just so stiff on these hoes or some shit. you like, I'm proud of myself. So, I feel like you cheering yourself on, shit. That's what's up. I feel you on that, okay? So, yeah. Ooh, damn. You really throw the ten of cups. you like, yeah. Okay, so for some of y'all, y'all some little freaky motherfuckers. I see you could be masturbating or something like that just to throw that out there. Okay, I ain't gonna judge you, little freaky ass, but... Yo, know, some of y'all really, you like, damn, I really feel good, or I look good, or I'm really proud of myself, okay? Or something like that. What's the Queen of Wands, please? For Sagittarius. Now, I'm also getting you could be dealing with another first time you, who is deeply in love with you. You are very happy with this person. So, we have the Eight of Cups, Sagittarius. So, I see you are walking away. Let's see. Why Sagittarius walking away? What's going on? What? The Seven of Swords. Because you really, you found out somebody just... You finally understand that somebody is a liar, or somebody is just a cheater, or somebody is just like delaying your progress, your happiness. Okay, and I feel like you proud of yourself because you finally walked away from a lying, cheating ass person, or you proud of yourself because ever since you left this cheating, lying motherfucker alone, you just been like getting some good shit in your life. Like I'm just getting you're very proud of yourself. A lot of happy energy for you moving on. Okay, for you to have an encourage the momentum to be, yeah, definitely getting something about courage. You having the courage to be able to start something new, move on. Shit, that should make you happy. Okay, so what else here? What's going on with my Sagittarius? Okay, so the Queen of Swords coming out in reverse, clarifying by the lovers. Okay, what's the lovers and the Queen of Swords in reverse? Some of y'all definitely dealing with a Gemini. What's the Queen of Swords reverse lovers energy, please? Okay, so the Ace of Wands. So it seems like this person has an idea or it seems like this person is thinking of something. This could be any air sign, okay? Or this is someone who you have made a choice to leave behind or someone who coming towards you said this here is the made a choice to leave this person behind. This is someone who's very scarred. Somebody's very hurt, heartbroken through the source. Queen of Swords reverse. So they are trying to come up with the idea or what's this three of swords person? I mean, energy. Okay, so you have the Tower, the Star, and the Page of Swords. Could be Aquarius energy, okay? Or this is a Gemini, and this is a Gemini who's blowing up on Aquarius, who's watching the Aquarius because of you. But it seems like here, somebody is, is you feel very good about yourself. You're very proud of yourself, but somebody is very unhappy about themselves here. So with the Magician and the Magician of Page of Swords and the Devil, somebody is trying to create some sort of ending in your life. Where yo, where you won't be happy, okay? You can be feeling just like them, the five of pentacles. Like somebody is trying to literally, somebody is wishing on your downfall. Nine of cups, the devil, the nine of cups. Come on now, the magician, the page of swords. Like somebody, who, who is this queen of swords? Why this person so mad at Sagittarius, child? It seems like you, yeah, somebody is angry. Sagittarius, it seems like that you are very happy though. You are in the you are in the total opposite of whoever this air sign is. Somebody is blowing everything up out of proportion. It seems like they are constantly, constantly on the go of this this beef, this battle with you. Non-stop here. Give me more energy on this person. Don't, if it's not an air sign, it's someone who's very angry. So the ten of wands in reverse. 
So I feel like this person is like overworking themselves to do something. They are really, really burdening themselves to, to complete something, to try something, to do something. The Knight of Pentacles, the um the Knight of Pentacles and the Hangman, but something seems to keep slowing down for this person. It seems like somebody's life is just on pause and yours is growing. What's the six of wands? Okay, so the four of swords and the moon card. Someone is trying to get a victory at night. Okay, what is the moon in the six of six of wands? The ten of pentacles and the four of cups. So first of all, ten of swords, the temperance, the eight of swords, somebody in the four of pentacles down. So first of all, it seems like someone could be asking family, whoever this family, whoever the fuck this damn crazy person is that's mad because you happy to take serious, who is mad because you happy with someone else, or someone walked away from them and they this they person came to you. I don't know how this is playing out. Somebody just made this fuck at you, baby, regardless of whatever. This person ain't talking about shit. The reason why I'm just saying it so nonchalantly like this because. I just the, I'm getting the energy so strongly that you are in a very good space mentally, physically, financially, spiritually, everything. Even if you are not in that space of financially just yet, I feel like you are a powerful fucking manifester. You tell yourself every day you're gonna be rich. So I feel like just because that you have that mindset, like just because you have this mindset that's very powerful, your mind is like the the way you think, the way you move is a very is a strong threat for whoever this air sign or this crazy bitter woman is. Okay. And it seems like someone is trying to get their family to help them tag along to get some sort of successful outcome at night to, I don't know, do whatever the fuck. And they family like, no, bitch, I'm not helping you with that. Leave me alone. What's the four of cups, ten of pentacles, ten of swords, in this year? Somebody family is not helping them with that. Okay, so, yeah, we got the page of cups. Yeah, I just feel like this toxic-ass motherfucking karmic feminine energy. There is a real, really, really, really toxic feminine energy, man, that's here. Somebody could be... Um, a Libra, Capricorn, something like that. Aries here, Virgo energy. Child, somebody is very toxic, okay? They are making this offer to their mother, possibly uh, Aries, and in in, in, they're making this um, offer to, I said their mother. So they, somebody could be asking their mother. Their mother could be in some sort of boss position. Somebody is asking their mother or their father to help them with some shit, okay? You know, to help them do what? What is this help about? To the strength? Okay, yeah, there's somebody's definitely like, hey, can you come work with me? Can you partner up with me? The four of pentacles, the five of swords, the three of cups. Whatever this shit is, it's it's the strength card. It's bullshit. Magician, five of cups. Like so family not riding with this person against you. I don't know who this who the fuck this person is. I don't know. Some of y'all got a karmic ass fucking mama too. You feel real good, though. Ten of Cups. I'm talking about Ace of Swords. Three of Wands. Like, you feel real good. <laughs> the Hierophant. Like, you just not a cup. You just are. That's what I'm saying. You coming out right now. You doing the right shit. God, you know. you God is proud of you right now, man. You doing the right things in life. You really focusing on yourself. Three of Wands. Ton of Vision. Hierophant. You doing what's right for your life, your love, your whatever you need to do. And someone just, like, mad at that shit, man. Somebody's life is, like, destroyed. Their life is on pause, man. And, and 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 ever since you moved on with this person, or ever since you moved on away from this person, you moved on with someone who this person is connected to for some of y'all. Okay. For others of you, you just moved away from this person. You, you this was family, you just wanted to your distance. You you didn't you didn't fuck with it. Yeah, somebody is mad, they angry. They they coming up with ideas to give to family. To break your heart in some sort of way that's not working because family is refusing outcome of this situation here the nine of ones reverse hand